Today I'm going to share with you my technique on dealing with background images, to at least make them look good on desktop, tablet, and mobile. One important key factor of having an image background, especially on the header part, is to make your page appealing and grab user attention to explore more of your website. Though in reality, each of us doesn't have the same size or brand of monitors, tablets, or mobile devices. My approach to that is to find an image where your subject is in the middle and the top and both sides have a wide space gap. I am using depositphotos.com for this, but there are some websites that offer free images like unsplash.com, where you can use them for both commercial and non-commercial purposes. Let's use this image. As you can see, I look for a panoramic image where my subject is in the middle with space on top and both sides. Now let's crop the image in Photoshop, ensuring you have the same gap on both sides between the subject and the image corner. This will be for our desktop. Next, let us create a new copy for the tablet and mobile phone. Since most people use their handheld devices in portrait view, let's crop the image with more space on the top rather than on both sides. Now we have our images ready. Let's open our DB page. For this demo, let us add a text module for the content. We will leave it as a default for now. We will just give the text a nice format. I will also have a big title and a small text description. Also, I will add a background color for the row. Another piece of advice that I can give is to always enable the responsive view when editing text, because if you have a large title, for sure it doesn't look good on mobile, especially on small screen devices. Next, open the section settings and then the backgrounds option. Enable the responsive option by clicking on the mobile icon. For our desktop preview, let's upload the background we prepared for the desktop and set it to cover, and then choose center for the alignment. Then on your tablet, select the taller one where there is more space on the top part of the image. 
We can align the image depending on the design or the content of this section. Let's use the same image for the mobile. Save and close it. Then save the page, then exit Visual Builder. Refresh the page and try to resize your window. You may also try to use the inspect function of your browser. That's it, my approach to making the background image look good on different devices. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. See you on the next video and thank you for watching.